In this question, when we read the prompt, something is off with the word journeying. In the current expression, journeying introduces a phrase that modifies the bricks. Grammatically, it's independently of what's in the main clause, but the intended meaning is not truly independent of the manufacture in England of these bricks and the shiploading in the James River. The intended meaning is that England happened first, then the use is ballast, then the overland journey. So A is out. Let's look for an answer choice that expresses the intended meaning, specifically the chronology. B through D all fail to be grammatical English sentences. In B, journey is a verb without a subject. C and D have the same problem as A in the use of the word journeying. Furthermore, they are not proper expressions of a modifying phrase or a new clause in their use of the word and. E looks good. The use of the past perfect with had been is appropriate here. E conveys the fact that the manufacture and shiploading events occurred before the past tense event of journeyed. And by omitting the dependent clause here in E, we see that journeyed has a grammatical subject, which is bricks. The correct answer is E.